totally a black, a black tie type of truck. We have redone the front end. So we've actually eliminated the uh, traditional crosshair grill that we used to have. We went to something really blinged out. Uh, it's got ram across the front, full on chrome. I mean, chrome, chrome, chrome. You go to the side of the truck, a lot of got, chrome. there's a lot of chrome. Yeah. We got new belt moldings. We got a new uh, uh, belt moldings up there. And then you go to the back of the truck and we got ram about the, around the back. So really it's about making a statement, I think is the biggest thing with this truck. I think uh, having tension is great. We love having tension uh, within within talk and design. I think you, to a certain point, you don't people don't know what they don't know and they don't want yet, you know. And I think it's something going out there trying something different. That's what we're all about here at Ram. So uh, we we feel this truck's going to do great. Now in Detroit, you came out with the Rebel and it had the big Ram stamped mm -hmm. on the back of it. Yep. I see that here as well. Is that something? Is that like a design theme in the language that's going to be seen on more Ram products? We uh, we took the, we took the opportunity for these two vehicles to kind of get it out there, see what people feel like. Right now we're not about taking it across the board so the rest of our lineup still has the crosshair grill, still has the big uh, goat ram head on the on the back so uh, it's about kind of seeing reaction like like what's happening and kind of finding out if, if people are interested about it. Alright, talk to me about the interior. Yeah. So uh, obviously outside you have a lot of chrome, you have a lot of you have new wheels, yep. you have new design language. How about yep. on the inside? What's unique on the inside? The inside is really I think where the customer is going to, yeah, oh it's great. It's great leather. One of the coolest things is our Argento wood. You see that in the steering wheel. It's actually a black wood with a silver inlay to it, which is awesome. So it's all about little details. I think we want the customer to almost experience this stuff down the road. Maybe a year, oh, they find something extra, which is you pretty know, cool. I hate to use this word, but I know Bentley's is a bespoke, right? Yeah, yeah. Is that what this is? I, I would, I would, bespoke truck? I would consider that, yeah. This is definitely yeah, custom a, built, custom tailored. Yes, this is a set above, above anything. It, yeah, to me, it looks like something that you would get if you took it to a custom shop to, to say, hey, I want it to match my outfit or something like that. That's what we have in this truck. All right, now, have you released pricing yet? We have not released pricing uh, for this uh, new upgrade. But it's going to be the most expensive truck you can get. It's the most expensive truck in our in our lineup it is the top dog so we're looking you know 60 and above yeah and then you get into the 2500 3500 it's even more you add the cummins diesel and it. it's a it's a truck but you know what one of the things we found is someone towing someone pulling stuff their horses might be you know three times the cost of the truck this is this might be the cheapest thing they own in their stable you know i was uh, doing a run up the eye gauntlet in year 3500 with the cummins right yeah and we were towing a cimarron trailer and the trailer was a hundred and six Seventy thousand dollars. It was three times as expensive as the truck. It's amazing. It's amazing. I, I think that's the thing that we've learned. I I don't know if we're at the top yet of our truck market in terms of luxury. Yeah, yeah. And what are you the most proud of? I, I love our new center console that we've done in yeah. the interior. It's actually got a timbre door. It's almost like a roll top desk type of feel to it. You can hide the stuff. And then one of the coolest things that we've done is actually put a cell phone tablet holder that presents it to you, range sizes of phones. And that's something that we you know no one has within within our group here and it's something we've brought into the RAM. Thank you so, very much. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Thanks. Thanks.